Hello everybody, it's me, Chris and I, with, with two special guests. Hey, what's going on guys, L3 here. Hey guys, Baby Santos. <laughs> and uh, L3 kind of jumped in at the beginning there, so my bad. And <laughs> <laughs> hey, guess what everybody, this is not Assassin's Creed. Everybody gasps. <gasps> oh man, what, in the, what is the world coming to? I know, it's Brink. And voice must uh -huh. Everybody is asking, what is Brink? Brink is a RPG. RPG. Exactly what you say. <laughs> you lose <laughs> it's a shooter. <laughs> a first person shooter. <laughs> That's right. Well, take it away, man. <laughs> I have not played this game. <clears throat> Dude, it's a fun game. Funny, that's my character wearing all green, right? Alright, I found that guy, I was like, GET DOWN ON THE Fucking FLOOR! He said, he said, he said something cold, and I'm like, oh, okay. So I started to leave. That's well, obviously yours would be green. That's your favorite hey. color. Yes, the doctor. They stole maintenance something for engineering. Must be their getaway. <laughs> so literally, tell, 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 tell my viewers about yourself. I, I, oh, well, obviously I'm... Leader of the Outcast Templar for <coughs> Assassin's Creed. <laughs> I said legendary, but okay. Yeah, no, <laughs> there you go. You can hop right ahead. Yeah, that's okay. <laughs> no. So me, I am. I'm a gentleman and a scholar. Nothing special. But my husband. Can I do Assassin's you Creed videos? People jealous, you know that. <laughs> hey, 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 hey! Legendary is my husband. We got. The the, the the marriage like That's true. Well, what about magnitude? He got he got one too. Oh. What is polygamy? Yeah. See, I, I was not aware of this. Now <laughs> jump through this. I I I I don't think I don't, I don't think our viewers would in, enjoy listening in on this. That's just me. <laughs> okay. Well, like right now, I play I'm playing on the DLC called Agent uh, Agent of Change. I know, right? What, what, what a unique name for, for DLC. And, and right now, I'm playing as a soldier. A class that, like, give ammo, throw Molotov. That's my favorite Molotov. And, you know, and shoot people. <laughs> That's the best thing about it. Also, yeah, I could scavenge other people, so, you know, I'll be sucking their dick. <laughs> what? <laughs> when I play the game, this did not happen. <laughs> They're still sucking dick for me. I was just... Running, gun, and capturing the objective, and <laughs> try not to rage at how horrible the, some mechanics of the game were. Well, like, like even, even even though with with, with the with, with the mechanics the way they are, I still love the game no matter what. I'm keeping this game. I don't care what you guys say. I'm keeping this game. I I'm haven't played this game. Well, I played it. It's going straight to GameStop, <laughs> and, and soon. I just been too lazy. <laughs> Maybe you should just play it with Christian. Yeah, man. I mean, I have three PS3. There's where the whole little barrier is right there. I know, right? Yeah. Oh, so, so, wait, 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 uh, um. <clears throat> <laughs> what? <laughs> so what yeah, happened so with the with the whole um Uncharted? Uncharted? Oh man, I fucking gave up in that shit. <laughs> yeah, everyone else gave up. I was like, yeah, Uncharted. And everyone said, oh, I hate it. And then. Finally, finally, when I get a game on the PS3, nobody wants to play. <laughs> <laughs> no, well, well, finally, I got my reasons why I don't like Uncharted. Because Uncharted for me is is like stupid. I love the storyline, but like the game mechanics just wasn't for me. Right. For me, man, I, I'm all up to that. I love Uncharted. It's just. I'll, I'll 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 get Uncharted for you, Legendary. But like overall, like competitive playing wise, fuck no, fuck that shit. <laughs> I'm still debating if I am going to get it when it does come out because I'm so not active on my PS3 and there's so many good single player games that are coming out so I don't really know if I'm going to get Uncharted for that. But who knows, it's, there's a lot of cool multiplayer games coming out too. Yeah, but um, I was going to say, oh yeah, well like, let's talk about the gameplay here. I'm Shooting, that's it. That's <laughs> no, Did you say that for every Call of Duty game too, it's just shooting? Yes, but, 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 like, people find a way to say, it's more shooting! Even more. <laughs> and more! <laughs> <laughs> now with more shooting. <laughs> and more, and more quick scoping. And, and here. more care packages. <laughs> Alright. UAV incoming. 
Which, hey, they did add a UAV to this DLC, did they not? Yes, yes, they did for for the operative class. Right. You could you, you could you could you could make it go um to um you can make it as a kamikaze bomb. You know what I mean? So you, you could actually kill somebody with it. <laughs> Was there any new achievements to that game? Yes, yes, there is. There's, there's, there's two stage achievements when we complete this stage on both sides. Um, the other one is, is, is for your new skills. For the soldier, my favorite class, you get a napalm grenade. Basically, a napalm grenade. I haven't unlocked it yet, but like what, uh, what I read, the napalm grenade is like a Molotov, but, but like more stronger and more active than than, than a regular Molotov. Right. Then with the uh, with the engineer, he gets he gets more um, landmines that does pyro. So like a Molotov landmine. <laughs> <laughs> what's up? <laughs> what's up with bringing Molotov? I don't I don't know. I don't, I don't understand. <laughs> For a moment, I thought we were talking about Team Fortress 2. Molotov. <laughs> yeah, I, I really want to play that, but right now. My computer is so shitty. I need a uh, in about four weeks. Though, I'll be building my own PC. And, uh, that will be amazing. So I'll be playing uh, uh, awesome uh, PC uh, games. Uh, and also, if you if you look at my video, guys, uh, on my Chris, yes, the real name of that gun is called Chris. But like everybody calls it the Cross of the Victor. But the real name of that gun is called the Chris. <laughs> huh. Yes. You know, as you can tell, like, like, uh, there's a baronet there. That's 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 uh, that's one of the new uh, attachment for this game. For for, for your submachine guns. A bayonet. Mm-hmm. Huh. That's pretty interesting. To tell the truth, I failed at it. I failed at it. <laughs> we gotta try using it before I failed. <laughs> you see, I, as uh, well. A lot, a lot, a lot of people complain that, like, even though, like, you, you shoot the enemy, you, you uh, they don't die fast. When, but like, when they shoot you, 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 you die faster. Right. That's not that. That's not typically true because, like, they're aiming for the head. <laughs> so that's why you die fast. Right. Yeah. But besides that, the computers, of course, they, they, they got, they got the auto aim, uh, uh the, like the auto aim feature. Of course, you go die fast. <laughs> <laughs> But overall, like, the DLC is really good. I have to admit, it was really good. It was free. It's a free DLC. Yeah, you can't beat that, I guess. Mm -hmm. and, that, and, that, and, that's, and that's why I love the DLC. Except Assassin's free. Creed beat it, because it, there's two free <laughs> DLCs for Assassin's Creed. No, but, but yeah. it was counteracted by that third one that you had to pay, and then... That's true. Shit happened. That's true. And you know, it'd be nice. The new maps were nice, but I'm kind of sick of the whole Assassin's Creed. Hey, you know, we're going to give you a new map. Surprise, it's a night version of it. That's not a new map. That's just the night version. <laughs> no, no, but like I just, I, I just love, how, I just love how some people say, "Oh, look, it's a new map! Wow, it's so brand new." Yeah. Really? <laughs> <laughs> no. Well, like in this part, I, I, I failed to protect the door. I was like, "Oh man, now I gotta do all this shit again." <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's essentially what it is. You and Brink, you just come in waves of defending and. Whatnot. That fun, I don't mind because I, like, I love, I love objective based games. Like bring Battlefield back company. Yeah, yeah, I, I'm definitely up for, up for that. You know, it promotes teamwork, but, mm -hmm. um, yeah, like I said, I'm de definitely up for that. Like games such as Battlefield, when you have a medic and an engineer, you know, engineer repairs the tank and whatnot. And here on Brink, you have a medic which can revive people. Things like that that involve teamwork, I, I really enjoy instead of being. The whole oh I'm gonna rack up this many kills and be the lone wolf on my team. You don't you don't feel as accomplished in my opinion. Like, yeah. You know when everyone's doing their part, you all feel accomplished. Yeah. And that's why and, and that's why and that's why I I bash on Call of Duty sometimes. It's like that game is mostly lone wolves. There's no real teamwork into it. Yeah, that, that's true. I mean every now and then I have to be in the right mood. Mood I, I don't care to play it, but it, it's the whole uh, like you said lone wolf thing. And there's, of course, there's other problems with it, but I mean, I'm sure, I'm sure everyone's aware <laughs> of the problems the game has. Yeah, well, like, but, but, like, um, what's, what's really popular about that game is the snipers, for some reason. You, you, you gotta, you gotta be, you gotta, you gotta do that bolt action, no scope, quick scoping, 360 dance, uh, do the Macalena, 
Yeah. That's yeah, it. That's, <laughs> that's, <laughs> yeah, that's that's what it, Modern Warfare 2. If you play that, that's essentially what it is. You know, do the Macarena right off the edge of the building. But hey, if you pull it off, it does look cool. But it's the whole trying to pull it off, and everyone's trying to do the same thing. So you yeah. see bodies flying from the air, doing 360s. You know. No, I, I but like, I, but I remember one time I was play, I was playing Modern Warfare 2. And basically, uh, it, it was a certain destroy. My, my my whole team died besides one guy. He was a sniper. Oh. It, it was a one on one match. But he he, he saw he, he saw the the guy, but he didn't kill him because he keeps doing 360 no skulls. But he died. Uh. <laughs> there's there's really like there's really no point in knowing how to no scope if you're just gonna keep getting killed over and over again. Mm -hmm. That's true, but uh, people try so hard for that one piece of footage. They want that one little piece of footage to put in their their montage. The montage. Yeah. yeah, yeah. And the thing is, like you know, they may have their little. Uh, it's like I want that 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 nice shot of a quick scope because it's gonna make me look so badass. But then when you actually play the play the guy, they they just suck unbelievably. Yeah. yeah. In my opinion, what makes a true player is if you. It doesn't matter your kill death ratio. It's if you play the objective right, if you're playing with the team well, stuff like that. That, you know, see, seeing how you play with the team matter, matters way more than me than um, just, you know, doing awesome quick, like quick scopes or 360 no scopes. I mean, trick shots, they, they look okay, but you get them once out of every 30 matches, it kind of takes away the deal, I guess. Well, I, and that's why, and, that, and that's why I play Bring Serious, you know, as a serious gameplay, because, like, I love the teamwork here. Even though, even even though sometimes like I act like a lone wolf, but when but 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 when people ask for my help, I actually come running back through through a hell of gunfire just to back up my teammate. Right. And 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 um and, and Brink, we we um and Brink, what what we really love about this game is the grenades. They don't kill you instantly. That's what I love about it. That's true. So like yeah. you, you know like there's no that. Random grenade just comes out of nowhere and kills you. Yeah, it can knock you down, but like you said, it yeah. can kill you. But like a, a, lot, a lot of people hate it. So besides that, it's a game. It doesn't. It doesn't have to be realistic. <laughs> yeah, that's true. But there, for me, I mean, everyone has different opinions, you know. Except Xantos hasn't played it, so. <laughs> yeah. But, yeah. It's really. I can't really comment on this much. I'm. But uh, I'll try. <laughs> I mean, if, if for me, it's not. It's not terrible, it's not the greatest game, but uh, I'm usually really optimistic about games, but it's just not for me, I guess. The easiest way to say it without, you know, go, go well, too much like, detail. This is, this is like the reason why I play this more than, than any other shirt. It's like I said, like I feel like, you know, I, I feel like Assassin's Creed, but also with a gun. Right. <laughs> <laughs> Because because in here they, they they got this new mechanic called the smart system, but like it's it's really just free running. Yeah. You get you, you get you get more free running abilities, but it really depends like what what body type you have. If you have a heavy body type, <laughs> you can't free run at all. No, no, you really you really can't. Because you know yeah, he walks very slow. Yeah, usually I, I just play the medium body type. I find that to be most effective. If you're, you know, if you're playing more seriously, because the heavy, there's not a huge damage difference you can take. The light, you can barely take any damage, and the only difference is you can do like a little wall run thing. Yeah. So. But but like but, but like I have some friends who play this competitive as well. They're uh, uh uh they like they like to pick light because the reason is because like they could they could count on the speed of, of the of the character to, to save their lives. Right. Which is true because I fought them while while they light. Even it, 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 they know they know they know I have a good shot. So like so like they, they use their speed to mess up my aim. Oh yeah, that makes sense. Mm-hmm. I mean, it's definitely fun. Like, if you want to have the most fun for me, I mean, I wasn't competitive or anything, but I, I played the light class. <laughs> that was just I, I found it would be most fun. But uh, if I'm in it to win it, you know, and I'm playing with a team, uh, <laughs> which is very hard to find on the 360, by the way. And most people played it the first day, and because it was so it was so laggy, I'm, 
everywhere. You could not play it at all, so most people just uh, send it back. But eventually, I would find a team, and uh, yeah, I, I would usually pick me, like I said. <laughs> well, but, like, also, what, what I really like about this game is that, like, when you put front. attachment, there's a sacrifice. Yeah, yeah, I see that's, what you're saying. That's, that's, that's what I really love about it. So, like, if you want more ammo, well, you got, you got to sacrifice your accuracy. If, if, if you, uh, 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 if you want, like, uh, like a silencer, of course, like, your, your damage will suffer. Right. Yeah, you really gotta, you know, pay attention to what you're doing and, mm -hmm. you know, like you said, there's a sacrifice to everything. I don't, I don't really remember what I used a lot, but... Mostly when I go for guns, I go for stability because there's too much recoil and I can't hit anything. Then <laughs> it's kind of pointless to me. But even if it has low damage, if I can, if I can get a shot off, I I usually just usually go for steady aim on whatever guns I pick. Well, basically, uh, uh, the, the the assault rifle that I'm using now is called the gr the ground AR. With it, I'm using um, a tape a tape magazine, so basically I could reload faster. But the problem is, I'll, I'll, I'll lose accuracy on it. Right. But, but to counter that, I, I, I got a grip on my assault rifle. But the problem with that is, <laughs> when when uh when I try to take it out, it's slower for, 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 uh, for me to expect. Right. And, uh, and, and with the... Uh, and also, I put, I put a um, holographic scope. It's the same thing. Um, no, no, actually... Actually, it makes me it makes me carry less ammo. For some strange reason. <laughs> yeah, like maybe it's just me, but uh, if I remember right in that game, I don't remember if some of the sacrifices made sense. Like maybe you put a, a red dot sight on there, then you get less ammo or something like that. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, that could be wrong. That, that I didn't I didn't really get to be honest. <laughs> right. Yeah. It, it, it's more of the um, whole hey let's. We we want to put a little sacrifice on it there, you know, just a little sacrifice. <laughs> so like overall, like overall, like 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 I really love playing this game. I don't care what what anybody said. It has real potential. Yeah, it, yeah. To be honest, yeah, it could it could be like you know like delayed some more. You know, to to put like probably some more guns and maps on it to to make it more better and more fun. Yeah. But like overall, tell you I'm I'm enjoying what I have right now. Yeah, I mean that's I mean that's good if you know you enjoy. There, there's a handful of people that enjoy it. I've like, said in my first drink video I ever made that I think there will be a small community always around, like there is in Shadowrun, that will be playing this game. Speaking of Shadowrun, I haven't played that in a long time. I I've only played like once or twice. Yeah. Also, but like also there's clans in here in Brink, like you know like like any other clan like you know, um, Assassin's Creed. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah. Oh, just to let everybody know, Legendary is actually part of the Outcast Templar. Right, Legendary? That's right. Yep. Yep, say it proudly, Legendary. Say it proud! I'm playing Geometry Wars at the same time. I can't say it proudly or I'll die. <laughs> think! Think! Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, this this is going by really fast, actually. <laughs> hey, see, I told you. Yeah, it is. I told you. I told you. Know, you when we started the commentary, it's like Christian's like, hey, hey, want to join us? And I'm like, okay, sure, I got like 10 minutes. The video is 20 something minutes. Yeah, holy my shit. face win. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm all up for the. I, when I saw 20 minutes, I was thinking, oh my god, but this is definitely the most casual commentary I've, <laughs> I've ever done. Because like like uh, like I said like 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 yeah uh, yeah I'm a competitive. Uh, so literally, uh, I thought you knew that I am a competitive player, but I don't act like it. Right. <laughs> I <laughs> really don't. I, I mean, you joke around like uh, when uh, what's it called? What's it called? I'm going for the, the IGN I'm thing. Going. It's like the new death match. It's like oh, this yeah. is basically wanted, and it's like oh well, yeah. Yeah, but like there 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 were there were some people who, who didn't take that as a joke. Oh well, you you, you there will always be those people who are. Like so serious, and that they won't, they can't take anything as a joke, and you just have to live with that. You just have to, you know, whenever you play, you like meet those people, you know. Mm -hmm. I have no comment on this, by the way. 
Yeah. But besides that, besides that, I try, I try no, and make like, what do you, like, legendary, what do you think of those people who are, like, overly serious? Like, say you, like, playing with someone and, you know, you, you maybe, like, make a joke when you're playing against them and they take them all serious, like... You just, you can't change people. Uh, I, like I said, I don't really have a comment on this, <laughs> this whole ordeal here, kind of. Let y'all handle that, I guess. <laughs> yeah. But, 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 like, but, but, but overall, like, 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 like the, the, the reason why I record this is just because, like, there's th there's not enough ranked videos. I, I really like Brink. I, I don't care what everybody said. Like I said, I love the game. I <laughs> so like, I, I, I record what, what, what I want to record. <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. Hey, that's good. I mean. But like but like I do but I do ask the fans like you know like what uh, you know well, what they want to see. Yeah. I do ask them that. I'm not I, I'm, not, I'm not a fucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> Oops, I cursed. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no, somebody someone's gonna flag me or dislike the video. <laughs> <laughs> oh he just like the oh he's a fuck! What's this like? <laughs> he's making fun of Call of Duty and he's playing the super pink. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, he's a fanboy. What? what? I'm not playing a fanboy. <laughs> oh my god. If I if I if I have to really talk about fanboyism, I'd rather play Battlefield than Call of Duty. That's fanboy. Right? <laughs> yeah, that, yeah. That's that's not fanboying, but you, you you do make a distinction. Yes. Well, usually if you, you throw Battlefield Call of Duty the same sentences, you better freaking yeah. run because there's gonna be someone with a nine millimeter <laughs> uh, jump you or something. <laughs> I mean, or a revolver, or they have their handy little knife. No, yeah. No, exactly. no, 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 no. Or a go, care package. No, no, no. They go, they, they go try to, um, they go try to, uh, do uh, through a 360 no scope backflip, Macarena. Oh, uh, Michael Jackson moonwalks, uh, no scope me. <laughs> and fails, because you were in disguise. <laughs> Damn right. <laughs> I'll the Buddy, I, I hate, I, I hate when other people pick my doctor, but like, but I'm never, but I'm never that persona. <laughs> I'm, always, I'm, I'm always someone else. <laughs> Well, like the uh, the uh, uh, the video is coming to an end. So, like, uh, what you guys think about the video? <laughs> yeah, I mean, it's it's Brink. It's different. <laughs> I want to know Xantos because he's never actually played Brink, so. Well, it is something different. I would actually, try it out. Yeah. yeah. If you if you yeah. never tried it out before, definitely definitely try it out. But it's not <laughs> it's not for everyone, like I've said before. Yeah. Well, this is Christian Knox. And this is my two special guests. Would, would, would you would, would you like to say the goodbyes? Yeah. Uh, see you guys. L three out. See ya, everyone. This is Abe Zantos signing off. <laughs>